Hey guys, it's Frozy Tech with another fix back on a new video. And today we'll be talking about how you can fix isdone.dll and unarc.dll generally showing in all the problems. Now, first of all, I would like to tell you guys that I'll be continuing more and uh, late work because uh, <coughs> I was busy with my exams and all that, so I was late in releasing this one. So, do make sure to like this video and hit subscribe, it's gonna help me a lot. It's getting sad, let's get started. So first of all, generally in using that unarg.dll or other files, there are many errors shown up. If you're getting something error like archive is corrupt, then I think this fix won't work because the archive is actually corrupted. That means you need to download it again. But if you say something else like dash one or something else, you can search it here. Go to dllfiles.com. The description, is, uh, the link for this uh, website is below in the description. Just search for. I is in the deal and search the DLL file. Okay, so here it is. I is then dot DLL and we're gonna click on this. Now, the best thing which I would do is uh, that you can simply uh, just manually get this file. And if you want to purchase this, then it's up to you. You have to waste fourteen dollars on it. Well, maybe not forty, fifty. Okay, so we're gonna go on here. So this is both for thirty-two bit system, but that's gonna work for us also. If you're having sixty-four one like mine. So, we're gonna come down for the latest one. So, zip file and all that. Uh, just go to click on download. Okay, so here it's gonna start in 4, 3, 2, all right. Okay, so that's done for K. Okay, we got unknown. Uh, so, we're gonna go again and type on arc.dlm and gonna search for this DL file. But you can click like this just click on it go below and the only thing we have is click on download and yes we're gonna get that too <coughs> sorry okay so we got both the files we need so what we can do let's go to where we downloaded them all okay so here they are let me go back to downloads and yes we got on arc and i is done Let's get this file back on desktop. Okay, so the first thing I want to tell you guys is that generally file which comes from the internet is blocked. You can just simply right click on it and block file. Maybe this option won't be present in your PC because I just opened it using the registry. Just go to properties and click on unblock, apply, and okay. That's going to do the work. Do the same for both of them. Okay, so then when both's done, just right click on it and extract files and okay. Yes to all. So let's delete this one. We do not need that. Okay, so we got these two files. So what we're gonna do here is that these files are unblocked and we're gonna minimize this for a second. Now if you got a 32 bit PC oops, I don't need this. Let's go to Windows and click anywhere because this is in 32. Okay, so system 32 if you're having a 32 bit PC. And if you're not, you're like your in my my case if you're ha I'm having 64 and if you are too just go to instead of going to system 32, we're gonna go to a system while 64. So we're gonna go in both of them. So let's go back oh, where I've got it here. So let's copy these both files. Go to plus C or just right click and copy and open them up in here and go to system32 and paste these files here maybe I got these four files already so let's go back and in this one and again paste these files here and gonna replace them okay so that's done for one let's see where is that let's check okay so the next thing we're gonna do is that we're gonna register these two DLLs and how we gonna do that just right click on the start button and click on command prompt administrator and if you're having any other window just click on to start and type cmd cmd will show up something like this and window start or something like that just right click on it and run as administrator and it's gonna do the same one administrator maybe the system power is different so let's click here and okay so maybe I type that up and type in I no I guess did we can type in reg which is registry svr32 we're gonna register those other registries and type in is done dot dll do make sure the uh, the spelling match exactly what the file name is 
So let's press enter. And generally, what I found is that this error occurs. Never mind for that. This already shows. So just click OK and head on. And instead of this, type in on arc dot dll and enter again. And that's gonna go the error. So never mind for that. Just click on. Uh, you have done all the things you needed. And simply restart your PC is gonna fix the error. So that was it for today. And do make sure to subscribe. And, uh, Thanks a lot for watching. Firstly, thank you guys. I'm Fuzzy Deck and I'm...